So I wanted to come to you all to talk to you about the African Pride line, the new line that's out, the, I think it's called Moisture Miracle. <sighs> if you guys have watched some of my older videos, then you know that I'm a stand for African Pride. The, I think it was the Curls Bounce Pudding or something like that. Like, I loved it so much. It was literally the only cream that I would use to twist my hair for a while. Um, so when they came out with this new line after years, I was like, oh my gosh, I have to find it. Couldn't find it at any Walmart whatsoever. I finally found it at um, Dollar General, but Dollar General doesn't have all of the products. So Dollar General only has um, the leave-in cream, the leave-in spray, shampoo, conditioner, and I think that's actually it. So if you're looking for the pre-poo, the mask, or the, um, and I think it's like an oil or something like that, then you, you're, you're not gonna find it at Dollar General. But anyway, so I was able to find these products at Dollar General. My friend was able, shout out to Alexis, she was able to uh, grab me the pre poo and I was able to find the mask at my local beauty supply store. So let's go through the products, girl. Okay, so we're gonna go with the shampoo. This is what the shampoo looks like. This is the Moisture Miracle Honey and Coconut Oil. Nourish and Shine Shampoo, Hydrates and Elongates, Natural Oils and Curls, Color Safe, Sulfate Free. I love this shampoo so much. Like, and I know when I say on like Instagram or Snapchat or something like that, like, oh, I can detangle with this. Like, I know that's not the purpose of shampoo, but when you can detangle with your shampoo, it's an A++++++++ for me, personally. So I have been using it. As you can see the bottle, like I have squeezed the life out of this. Like I love this shampoo so much. It's literally all the way down here now, so I'm gonna have to get another one. But the price point on these products are pretty good. They're right about $4.99, I believe. So I really love this. I hope eventually they come out with a bigger bottle trust me you are going to love this shampoo if you get it I, like there's no way there's no way that you're not going to like it cleans your hair and it's moisturizing AF like you're going to love it mm. the conditioner this is a moisture miracle honey chocolate and coconut oil nourish and restore conditioner helps to repair and replenish moisture to natural coils and curls why can I not say coils I'm like oil <sighs> so this is what the conditioner looks like as you can see I've squeezed the life out of this bottle I'm not a fan of the conditioner I feel so bad saying that but I didn't like it at all I used it twice because the first time I was like oh well maybe I was just so hyped up over the shampoo that to me I'm feeling like the conditioner is like eh. but no the second time I used it without using the shampoo and it's just I don't get no moisture out of it. The bottle is horrible. Like, you have to squeeze the bottle so much, you might as well take the freaking top off, which, don't wanna die in the shower. I just, no. I, I don't feel the moisture in this. There's, mo like, literally the shampoo could be the conditioner. Like, it's that moisturizing that the conditioner just did nothing. I didn't even smell the chocolate, girl, and I was waiting for it because I like chocolate. I'm not a fan. So the next products would be, they, they have two leave-ins. One is a leave-in cream, one is a leave-in conditioner. So the, the leave-in conditioner is a spray. And it says shake the mix. It's coconut milk and honey, hydrated shine, leave-in conditioner, refreshes and softens natural coils <laughs> and curls. The other one is the coconut oil and baobab. Is it baobab or biobab? Oil. Hydrate and strengthen leave-in cream, provides intensive moisture, and helps repair natural coils and curls. <laughs> I like one over the other. I like the leave-in cream, and I don't like the spray. The spray has a weird spritz, period. So it's like, period. <laughs> Those who like city girls, ah. Um, so, when you spray this on your hair, it's like you get a little bit out. And it's not like you can adjust the nozzle, so it's just like, girl. You might as well take the top off and just pour it in your hands, but then it's like, well, doesn't that defeat the purpose of being a spray? It does. 
So, and I feel like because how it sprays out of the bottle is so minimal, like you'll be there for <laughs> you'll be there forever. Literally, unless you have a Caesar haircut, you you'll be there forever. The leave it cream though. Girl, I really 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 like this one. Um it's very moisturizing. You don't have to use a lot of it. And honestly, if you just use a leave-in cream and then just want to twist your hair, which I did last week, bomb. Take your hair down with some um, Jamaican black castor oil on your hands. Get the shine, you get the moisture, like your twists will look curling cream. So this is the Shea Butter and Flaxseed Oil Moisture and Define Curling Cream. Shakes, hydrates, and adds shine to natural coils and curls. So I really like the curling cream. Um, I, I wouldn't use, well, curl and cream. I wouldn't use this on a wash and go at all. Sometimes when products just say curl and cream, it's like, okay, well, we, we, like, what are you actually saying here? I wouldn't use this on a wash and go because it is, it's really, it's really thick, but then it's kind of like runny. Um, so I wouldn't, it's so much hair in here, I like, can't even, but I, I feel like if you use it on a wash and go, depending on how heavy handed you are, you might have a hard time getting it to dry. But I've tried it on a twist out and a braid out and I really, really like it. I don't know if this would be a staple, like the shampoo and the leave-in. It's good, but I don't think like I would run to it. But it's good, like it's, it's not bad. So the last product that I wanna talk about is the Moisture Miracle Moroccan Clay and Shea Butter. Detox and soften heat activated mask. I honestly love this mask so much. And the fact that it is only, I think it's like $5.99 or $4.99, is a steal. The bad part about it is I had to search for this. <laughs> like, it's not at the Dollar General um, because they don't sell the mask. I haven't been able to find this entire line at Walmart, period. Um, I had to end up going by my mom's house to a beauty, a local beauty supply store, and I was able to find this. You know, sometimes the beauty supply stores may jack up the price a little bit, uh, but yeah, so I had to go through all of that to find it. So it's not that accessible, and maybe that's only because it's new, but I really, really like this. Like, my hair felt so soft. I didn't even use that much of it. Yes, it's hair in there because I used it. But it's really, really thick, but I didn't use a lot of it. So that's good, and I have thick hair. Like I cut my hair and it's a little shorter, but it's still thick. So recap, love the shampoo, would die for the shampoo. Not a fan of the conditioner, no. Um, the two leave-ins, I like the leave-in cream, don't like the leave-in spray. I like the curling cream, like I'm not gonna go crazy to try to find the curling cream, but it's still good. Um, I love the deep conditioner, but I can't find it. <laughs> and I have the pre-poo, but I haven't used it yet, so I'm not gonna really talk about that one, but I heard that it's amazing. That is my review for the African Pride products. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, and I will talk to you all very soon. Thanks for watching, bye.